What would it look like in orange? What? Orange. The interior. The interior? No, Ferrari won't let you do it because they'll, they'll kill you for it. They yeah, say that's too ugly. That's too oh, ugly. God. God. <laughs> <laughs> that's got to be replaced. We've spent the last 25 years building a business together. Now we're building the ultimate driving collection. All while having fun with family and maybe kicking a bush or two along the way. Well, it's nice to like see you and meet you uh, at least virtually. Absolutely, we'll have to get a uh, visit together at some point. I like the background you guys have behind you. <laughs> right, right, very specific background for this, yes. for this spec session. I like it, I like it. I'm in our configuration room here at the dealership. Oh, it's so beautiful. Where, I wish we were there yeah. with you. I know, I know. I sent you some paint samples. Obviously, let you guys take a look at all that. But uh, we'll come up with something pretty cool here. Let's put those over awesome. here. Got a lot of reds here. Got a lot of reds and a lot of blues. That's what I was told to send. <laughs> right. <laughs> I think Ferrari red, you think of almost only one or two colors, but we've got quite a nice selection. That's gray. Right. That's more of a gray. Yeah. Okay. So what? So we'll say this blue elder. Yeah, blue elder. That's the one you almost you really have to shine a light on that. That car, that color has a lot of uh, you know different undertones, but that is a little bit more of on the gray family for sure. Right, blue elder. This is yeah more of a gray. Uh, probably won't go with that. It's good to see. This looks like your Roma. Is this Not your sim Roma? What similar? I doubt it. The Roma itself is called actually Blue Roma, so it's very similar family in terms of the color. I really like my Roma, by the way, a lot more than I had expected. There might be uh, there might be an open top in the future, maybe, maybe, maybe. For sure, <laughs> hell yeah! It's such a comfortable, nice ride, and then you can get on it and have fun too. I just I just love it. And it's definitely you know understated in the design, which uh, you know is something you can get away with driving around. Right, that makes it perfect for a daily. You don't feel it's like, like a midnight blue. You're driving some crazy car that's drawing a lot of attention. Th this was one of our favorites, this uh, blue Electrico. This I think is similar to the 675 Aurora Blue. It is. Right? Yep. Okay, yeah, because I saw yep. one on a car and it looked like, because I love our 675 Aurora Blue. It's one of my favorite blues that we've ever done. How about that blue that is on your, his car? Okay. What what blue oh, is that? Oh, cer Cerulean? Yeah, Cerulean. Yeah, it's definitely, the blue Electrico is a little bit darker than the Cerulean blue. Yeah, right. do you have that car made in that color? So that's something, when it comes time to doing like a custom color on a Ferrari, it's usually about a six to 12 month lead time uh, where they have to send paint samples back and forth if it's a color that Ferrari has never done before. I would say out of the blues, do, do you like these two blues? Uh, yeah. Do you like this at all or no? Probably not. Okay. You, is this too dark? Yeah. Okay, so aqua blue too dark. So it looks like the only blue that we're picking from this side that we like is the Electrico. Do you want to switch okay. sides with me? I picked my favorite red. Why don't you look at the reds? I'm going to pick my favorite blue too. Screw, I'm going to turn my screen around too to kind of show you. You know, I'm showing a red. If you just say you want to see something in blue, all I have to do is just hit one thing and I can show you guys, you know, different colors inside outside you know that kind of stuff this is too orange isn't it yeah I, I don't like the orangey ones for sure right this is this uh rosso portofino is really cool that's cool i agree i like this one the best right personally the rosso portofino yeah. would be mine that's the one i picked that was my second favorite oh it's got to be a darker one right is it I, this i can't tell you, you got to pick one more try to pick one that was my number two I had two of them that I liked well beyond the other ones. What is that one? That's the Rosa Portofino on the screen. See, I think this Portofino will be a lot like your um, your Wyra BC Roadster. That dark. Okay, pick what, try to pick one more that you think my favorite was. See if you can. Here, get why don't you do, do? you want to pick another one from here? Uh, no, no. Pick I, another. Pick your second favorite. I don't, I don't want to. I, this is my first. <laughs> That's it. That's what I. That was my favorite. A little bit darker. Okay, you know what? I like. You see, it looks more I red. Like, this like looks, that this kind of carries a little bit of the orange look when you put it together. You know, the, the one on the left looks almost more maroon. This is bright, brighter. Right. When you put it like that. I say we go with this. What do you say? I told you that was my first. That was well, my look, first favorite. Well, look, I we like. We can take some time. Right. I like this and this. So you know, you you know, if, if, if that's the the favorites, you you make the final selection. These are. Is this it? I think so. I love those. Both, both of those are my favorites. Right. Electrico and... So we got what? Uh, blue Electrico and Rosso Portofino there? Uh, Marinello. Got it, okay. Just kind of that depth of the paint. I also, one thing to note, 
uh, the black roof on the SF90 Spider is a no cost option. It's done in a non metallic black. Um, we can, it kind of gives a little bit of a LaFerrari vibe versus when you take the black roof off, you kind of. Yeah, yeah I, I like roof. the black roof. I, I definitely like the black roof. Yeah. And how about the, the spoiler in the back? So in the back of the car, the only way to change that spoiler to do like a carbon fiber spoiler is if you add the Assetto Fiorano package, which is almost a little bit like a YSAC pack on a Porsche. So it's a little bit more track focused. There's different suspension. Yeah, exactly. Right. So yeah, so you want to stay away from that, right? right. Yeah. And it's more expensive. You know, you got to do the shields on the fenders. I think if you take those off, it looks a little... Uh, oh, yeah. oh, oh my God. That, that even looks just weird. No, I wouldn't even want that at all. Yeah. That's free. It's I, but even if you paid me, I wouldn't want it. That's the standard wheel. You can do that in uh, like a silver or like a, a matte kind of gray. And then you have the upgraded forged wheel, which most clients go with. A little bit different design. And then you can do that in silver or the diamond cut. The diamond cut to me, yeah. We like that. I love that, yeah. Well, look, just just to give you an idea, your uh, 458 Special over there is red with yellow calipers. The LaFerrari behind you is red with red calipers. The yellow the yellow works well because the shields are yellow. Yeah. You like that? Yeah, exactly. Perfect. All right, and then uh, we'll go to the back of the car really quick. Exhaust pipes, um, standard is a bright chrome. I have them here in black for you. Uh, ties in pretty nicely with like the rear diffuser on the car. Um, you can also do them in a, like a tight. Silver's too hard okay. to keep you can clean. Do titanium too. Oh, can you do titanium? Is that an option? Yeah, titanium is an option. It's a night. It's like a brushed silver finish. Right, which will turn blue over time, right? Yeah, depending on how hard you drive it. <laughs> right. Titanium. I, I would probably choose titanium because I, I like it, that what, bluish. How much is that option? Uh, it's about $1,800 to do the titanium. Yeah, that's fine. Let, let's do that. I like that. You know, on the outside, at least, the only other options I think that we had kind of previously discussed is all the lower black, you know, matte black trim down the sides in the back of the car. I think it's wise on this build to maybe leave that in the matte black as opposed to doing all the carbon. You know, that kind of stuff can get a little pricey over yeah, time. Like we'll we'll, no we'll keep it on the cheaper side of things. Yeah. yeah. That's cool. good. I like that. So that's kind of outside uh, outside done. How about the seats? Can we get bigger seats? Well, you have the racing seats in yeah, 296. So they have a um, comfort seat. That seat in your 296 is actually not the comfort seat. I know that, but the, yeah, they're so comfortable to me. Right, but they'll but there's be, a comfort seat they'll be more, more comfortable. comfortable. Okay, Plush. like that. Plushy. Yeah, yeah, this yeah like is that's the, like a wide leather. Uh, this is a seat on the car that I'm showing called a style seat, which gives you the option to put that red stripe down the middle. There's also some other red that we can kind of play with on the inside. Uh, and then in terms of comfort seats, really the only other thing that you can do if you want to do something a little bit more traditional maybe is to go with a Daytona style. Now, the, the only question I would have for you is, do you want a more red interior, or do you, or, uh, or do you like? It I like, like that? that tan. Oh, you like tan? You want to try the tan? We can I, try. I like the tan. I think. Yep. Curio, I think, is the best tan. What do you think? That's it. Because you, your 458, remember, was red over tan. Yeah. You, your first one. Um, this is a really nice one. Is that the Curio you have got shown? Exactly. Okay. I really like the Curio. I I, I like the tan. I don't know if, if you, yeah, it's something different too. That like, everything's kind of black or red. Yeah, but it looks like that. traditional Ferrari. I love that. Yeah, I do too. Right. That, that looks good. And then we can, you know, you could do red accents like what's kind of shown here, or we can kind of play around with that. I think to have a little bit of red in the inside wouldn't be a bad thing. The stitching is red. So if I kind of zoom in here, for example, like on the dash and then on the edge of the seats, everything will have uh, a red stitch on it as well. I also did the Cavallino, the horse, and the headrest, and then the uh, the seat belts as well. I love the horse up there. Yeah, I love the, that red. Red seat belts go with it. I think that looks good, yeah. What would it look like in orange? What? Orange. Well, like a dark orange. What, the whole car? The interior. The interior? You can't go red and orange. Red and orange? Uh, it, that, that Ferrari actually won't. Oh, yellow. It. No, Ferrari won't let you do it because they'll, they'll kill you for it. They say that's too ugly. You know that they actually do that? They, they do. They if don't it, like it. If it, if it like is a horrible looking thing, they'll just say you're not doing it. 
I don't know. I've seen some horrible specs. Yeah. So. That's true. We don't we don't want this thing ending up on worse spec online. Yeah, right. <laughs> yes. Yeah. My recommendation on on these kinds of cars is you know if it's going to be a car you th you have in the profile for a year, two years, have some fun, play with it. You know, build a really nice car, but don't necessarily go too crazy. I think if you get you know once we get up into the collectible stuff, the limited series, that's when we can start playing with like tailor made and do liveries and stripes that take it kind of to the next level. Right, like if like if we were doing the, the SF90XX, that would be like all carbon, we'd be going crazy on that thing. Yeah, I mean, I, I love that. I don't know if you wanna, are, are those red paddle shifters? Yeah, can we look at the steering? So, yeah, so one thing I, one thing I did is I added earlier for you guys a little dream line on the painted, on the edge of the uh, paddle and then the 12 o'clock marker on top of the steering wheel. So you have to get carbon fiber to get that. But it's, you know, little details like that that kind of dress up the interior. There's a, actually one more thing if you like it, I can show it to you. Underneath where it says SF90 on the dashboard, I can have a little Tricolore painted there as well. Can you get American colors put there? <laughs> no, nobody's gonna want American. Not, no, not, not, not through this. But maybe you know, through TaylorMade, we definitely can. I did a little bit of carbon. I didn't do every carbon option. So what I did is I did the driving zone, which is the steering wheel, the paddle shifters. I did the dashboard trim, and then I did these little kind of scallop pockets in the door here, which that normally comes in Alcantara, but it adds just a little nice kind of touch to it. I like that having having, yeah. having like the inside it, it, a little bit. That, that, uh, Super guys. that screen looks exactly like the 296. And the Roma as well, you know, throughout the family, they're really going into similar uh, usage on the car. So you really know what you're, uh, what you're playing with. Okay, so you, you want to see it in blue now? Gosh, that's gorgeous. I, I love that spec though. For... I do too. I do too. The red, it's, oh, I do. this blue is so nice too. It's going to be. You know what? Let's, let's split the car down the middle, half red, half blue. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Man, I don't think that's gonna work. That's oh, that's good. I don't know. I love both of them. But that's gosh, so good. That blue looks good. Yeah, it really stands out. That does stand out. This blue. I mean, we might. You know what? I mean, if Every, we, everybody has red Ferraris. Maybe we do the blue. That, that blue is a gorgeous blue. With the blue, though, you know, to me, to me, the red, the Rosa Marinello, you can play along with. A little bit more elegant or sporty and i think with the koyo interior you guys did something a little bit more on the elegant side to me blue electrico really screams you have to do something sporty so i think you would almost have to stick with a you know like a black interior with some blue highlights well i, I picked that blue the blue is gorgeous and we don't have a blue ferrari do i know we? that oh, no we well mama's a12 gts mm. right oh my god you're right it's right, right behind there. you what <laughs> Oh, <laughs> that's obviously a much, a much like we don't much have a blue one. one. Gosh, to me, I don't really think of that as a blue. I know, even though it is. Yeah. So what I'll do is I will save. I save that red render, so I'll send that to you when I can, and then I'm gonna do a blue electrico car um, with a similar kind of vibe to it. I think we leave the outside alone. We leave the yellow calipers. We leave those wheels, and we just modify the interior to have a similar like blue accents you know to play around with the blue outside and even again i can do like the the blue electrico dream lines on the steering wheel and everything i think that look really cool yes okay. i think that's gonna be the one that's in no god it's so it's so good <laughs> because it does look so common yeah i think like sf90 i agree I mean, maybe we do pure Songwe and the Rosa Marinello. You know, do play 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 with that because I, I want I want Rosa Magma if I ever get it. Maybe I'll change my mind by that long in the future. <laughs> no, you won't. You won't want to. Trust me, I've driven it. It's insane. It's there's nothing like it. Okay, well we'll let you get off. We we, we know you got to go, but yeah, if you just want to like finish that yeah. on your on your own time and just send it over to us. Hundred percent. I'll get something to you guys in a little bit. I'll uh, I'll text uh, you guys both and we'll go from there. All Perfect. right, man. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. Cool. Nice to uh, nice to see you guys and, and kind of meet you and we'll go from there. You too, All man. Right, Thank man. you. Thank you. See ya. If we're specking it now, it's going to go into production we'll probably in the next couple months. Really? That quick? Oh, you think it'll be that quick? I think so. Uh, I, think I didn't know. I don't, have, any, I, I don't have any expectation. I didn't, I didn't know. Go back to it. God. <laughs>
scare you? Did you do that on purpose? No, I leaned on it. Yeah, he did do it on purpose. He, I, no, I, I don't think he did really. <laughs> well, because th those horns are right on the steering wheel. I, I accidentally, when I'm backing up and I'm turning in a Ferrari, I accidentally honk every single time. I still like my Super Sport. I think that's the coolest car I ever built. I love that. Spectrum. You want to know what I think you're going to like the best? Sure, the new hybrid. Maybe. I think, I think you might like the gold Mistral. I think that's going to be Like, that is going to be so amazing. elegant and To have classy. a gold car in here, too. The last W16 ever made in the history of Earth. <laughs> that's got to be replaced. He's Took my bag. Okay. It is hard to see the sparkle. I look almost identical out of here. Me too. Oh! oh no! I wasn't expecting that at all. No, I thought 100%. Not at all. I thought that was for sure what we picked in there. Gosh. Why? You know what? Gosh, I, you know, but you see, now it's with my mind because now that I know that that's not the one we picked, I like the other one now. Me too. Because <laughs> I okay. thought that one was more orangey. I know. Now. Let's see it again. You're uh, shuffling them up. Anyways, I think it's blue. Anyway. I, I think it's blue too. But that that just okay. That's like the difference of like you can't just look at it inside. You got to get different lights on the colors. Jason, will you tell the audience about the, the future real quick for you? Well, if you haven't noticed, I'm a little hunched over. Like, let's see how straight I can get. Is oh, that you're so straight? Is that straight? I feel straight. Dude, this is crazy how much it's like. Yeah. Like your natural bulge. I know. Let me stand up. Oh yeah. <laughs> No, I've got a really bad um, herniated disc. It's really more ruptured. Oh yeah, I think that looks so It's gonna good. look really good. And you know what? Having the blue Ferrari, it's gonna look cool because like, you know, we try to do all the different stuff. Now I know it's blue. I'm just, everybody's gonna be like, great, another blue car, but look at it on the Ferrari side of things. Yeah.